Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, my darling MVPs. We are back from the land of the reunion, back to Mimi Shirley Mimi, the land of Mimi Shirley Mimi. <laughs> Are you yet to subscribe to this channel or is this still not a fat long thing? Kindly do the needful, please. Thank you. Merci beaucoup. So, guys, as it is hot, I don't want to waste much time, okay? What do you think about this Deji and Chichi Bruhaha? I'm very sure you all watched it, right? Okay, let me just play a little bit summary of what happened, right? They were all going to know. What I, what I would simply say about this um, Chichi and Deji stuff is that it is giving a case of a narcissist. Do you know who a narcissist is? Somebody... Who tend to, you know, play the victim when they are at fault. Like you would be having issue with this person and the person would end up claiming the victim. Trying to play into your head. That is who a narcissist is. So, it is given that, to be sincere, I'm going to be sincere right here. It is given that Chichi was all with Deji, with all of her heart, all of her mind, okay? But Deji was not man enough to tell Chichi that he is really not into her right with what chichi was saying on this reunion grant she was saying everything with her foot chest because you know there is a point you're lying when you're lying right against somebody you would actually see you literally see it on your face but chichi came out playing and pattern and was saying how deji was visiting her room how he was reassuring her that he actually really really do like her and actually you know wants them to have a thing but Zeji on the other hand was saying that he never let Chichi on that he has he told Chichi that he is this person that would want to take his time and not because of Ante because of the they are in a show and now want to you know just brew up something know that he before he gets into his feeling right that he would want to take his time not because of the mess in a reality show then he would just start falling on lovey and mushy I understand his point, okay? If he is not the kind of person that, you know, fall in love easily, it is cool. But at least relate to the person. Don't lead her on. That is where the problem is, okay? Even in the house, we all saw it that Deji was not really into Chichi. Like, you could watch where they played where Diana was telling um Chichi that Deji seems to be so relaxed for a hot guy like him that should be the ladies were even rushing him but Deji was laid back you know so that is one of the reasons why some of the netizens were actually brewing that he is an agege if you understand what an agege mean do you understand what agege mean if you do not understand please ask your neighbor i'm not gonna say that word in full so because the ladies were rushing Deji. Alice he left his relationship with um Adekunleo and the um, Hermes. I was going for um, Deji. Doin was going for Deji. You know, they were rushing Deji. The person that was not all over Deji like that was Chichi. In as much as Chichi was eyeing Deji, but she was maintaining her distance while love they enter her eyes. But Deji actually told Big Brother, I can remember vividly in the diary room, that amongst all the ladies that were that was coming for him, that the person he likes was Chichi. And in this particular reunion, what I like is Chichi. Chichi said it with her futures that love is not a crime and no key person, that she actually loved Deji in the house, okay? Not until they came out. And Deji also said she actually, not gonna lie, that he actually started growing feelings for her, like, like her. But when they come out of the house, he was not like that, like they need to, you know, get to know each other. And Chichi was saying that Deji was always in, in his house, sorry, in her house, you know, doing some kind of forming the boyfriend's, you know, characteristics, doing, take, doing the caring and everything, everything, you know. And Chichi said in South Africa that she wasn't actually really giving Deji's face. Like at a point she was like, they need to call it a quit. And Deji was like, she's going to just move on like that. In every bit Chichi was saying, in as much as I am not there, in as much as you were not there, right? But I feel Chichi is the person, is the person saying the truth here. Deji cannot even counter her words. The only thing Deji was trying to do is just trying to play the better person just to victim done to victim like trying to say chichi was going all you know like trying to fight and the was asking did they go physical he said no but he doesn't want to go deep with that but calling chichi that um how did he even put it about poverty something like that like um that big brother show was an alleviation poverty alleviation for chichi that was so low of him because if it was not for him, why did he come for the show to gain recognition, right? Anyways, guys, I would want you to let me know what you think about this Deji and Chichi thing, right? Because that was the only thing he could use for Chichi as Big Brother um show being a poverty alle alleviation that she came there to hustle and the husband shouted her. But when Chichi now said, but at least she was not sleeping with, you know, they asked me to actually laughing when Deji said that to Chichi. But when Chichi now said, but she, at least she was not sleeping with various old women, husband were like, ah, you know. And Chichi actually said something. She said that the husband never come to ask her on how far when she and Deji were not getting cool in the in South Africa. But the only person that came to her was Amaka. 
right? And she actually did say of Bella and Doi indirectly coming to tell her in the house that Deji not gets your back, oh. Deji is not somebody you should fall in love with. That of Doi, she actually said that it's not coming from a place of Doi do not like her, but Deji is placing it in a way that, ah, I beg, oh, Doi don't want us together. Why will you be spending some moments with her? So he registered that in her mind. So, guys, let's not just go front and back, okay? What do you think about this? Doi and um chi chi stuff okay as for me i think it's a case of a narcissistic fellow who wants you know tries to use her head and try to make her the bad one the villain of the movie so let me know what you think while we go to the social space and think and see what um some of the um netizens think okay deji wasn't in was not into doing as much as she was into him anyway talking about deji and doing i've always said this i think this one not be even too much talk doing was literally forcing herself to deji and deji came out came across like this guy who doesn't really want to have a thing with the ladies it was obvious he was showing it right he came across to them like i don't want to have anything with any of these ladies but the ladies were coming you know they the rush and woto woto like staying a hot bread so baby boy was like even that attitude that he doesn't want and don't don't you want a thing and you know how deep doing he is doing is this kind of person that is big on anything friendship or that so there is this level of friendship she wanted with seiji and she was not getting that vibe from Deji, no matter how she tried. So she was even asked in the reunion ground. And she was like, of course, Deji is a fine boy who wouldn't want to have a friendship with him. You know, she actually said her truth. One thing I love about Doi, she go talk her truth <laughs> without even minding anything. And I love that about her. She actually said her truth that who wouldn't like a fine boy like that. But now they try you. Now just they literally, they pursue these boys for nyash. Anyways, it is what it is. Dotsu actually, you know, Dotsu was um, Deji's best. When Deji was talking then, the way Dotsu was just looking like a... A woo. Anyway, Dotu said, Deji, you are a bad boy. Anyways, why I actually said it was because Dotu was just looking she like as if there is something he said about Chi Chi that he was praying that ah they should not bring me out. But at least he was free after all, if not for the some of the gossip him and Deji was doing in the house. Okay, this was the reply on Dotu's comments. A very bad boy, a very, 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 very bad. Don't use that word bad, Deji. Deji is useless, sneaking every night for Toto, shameless season. Very bad boy. Is it a shameless season? It is not a shameless season. And this season is actually interesting. Level up our with They kept us on our toes. Like we enjoyed everything in between, you know. The, the betrayal, the rivalry and everything. Okay, he said, Highlights of tonight's episode. Deji is still wicked and manipulative. Can't forget his statement about beauty. Chichi was very hurt by Deji and she hasn't moved on from her past. Diana is still very funny and will always talk her talk. As in Diana so funny, die. Like she was like, Are you sure this guy is not married? This one he is led back, okay. That she has stayed in the US and she knows how this, you know, this marriage marriage that's just for you to be able to settle down. Some of these guys get married to older ladies so as to get gain citizenship. So um Diana was seeing how a fine boy like Deji, you know, was you know, holding her back when all the ladies they rush her like hot bread and akara. Way, way hurt and she was he was just like giving the ladies attitude you know ladies are known to do that not guys but this one deji was literally giving the ladies attitude who was coming for him okay comrade attitude said summary of tonight episode chichi was sincere and very honest deji literally gaslighted his way through the entire conversation ladies allow the men to love you more brian is forever a sweetheart diana is hilarious some of your faith are still dumb <laughs> Why is this guy always using this thing at the end of any of his summary that some of the, uh, their faves is still up? Anyways, it is what it is. But the truth is, I, anybody that would say Chichi was not sincere in this, I would think maybe you're being biased right now. Because when you watch the show, you know that the person who was, you know, used here was Chichi. Baby girl was sincere from day one. She actually really do love this guy. She was even lamenting on it. On the reunion ground that I love, now love, I love, I no keep a sin. And my dear, to, to love is not a crime, but... Look, we they use our head as ladies, I beg. Guys, they use ladies' play. Anyhow, okay, love her or hate her, Chichi is one of the realest housemates of Level Up. She wears her emotions on her sleeves and acts accordingly. You could sense sincerity in her words. Exactly. I personally did sense sincerity in her words. Like, Deji cannot even counter the words. The only thing Deji was able to say was just the, the argument they were having on how Chichi goes, um, you know, vow sometimes like the one of have issues, you know. He said, I don't want to say anything, but the housemaid that laughed when Deji said Chichi was a poverty case, you all need help. The funny thing is they all laughed, but all of them came to that show. Most of them do not even have anything. Even as I am speaking to you, most of them are not really even making ways for themselves, but they are laughing because Deji actually mocked Chichi. You know, the least you can do to a person is mock them about their 
their life their life okay saying that but actually chichi is actually doing well for herself i believe so so it is what it is it's just you know they're trying to be defend himself they're trying to be defensive Aisha de la Cruz said, exactly, he should have man up and told the babe he doesn't want. We all watch what Chi Chi is saying that is not a lie. Baba was only good at telling everyone else he was not interested. Yes, exactly. Deji was, you know, telling people back backstage. We watched the clip. They were even played the clip there. Telling people that, ah, this girl, they forced herself for me. But to her, you are making her feel that, oh, all is well. Anyways, we, 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 could, we could read the handwriting on the wall because we are not the one in Chichi's situation, actually. Love is a... <clears throat> ah, Yoruba boys, uh, we get people, but le bad bitch. <laughs> Chichi the bad bitch, oh, bad bitch in the modest mode. Okay, Hectic General said... Okay, the platform was a poverty elevation scheme for her, but Deji, with all the money and connection you have, didn't you audition with her and wasn't selected? You had to settle for fake housemate duty and beg Biggie to somehow turn you into a real housemate. That is the fact right here. Spot on, baby. Because you are mocking her saying that it's, an, it's a poverty elevation, but she joined, the, she entered with other housemates but you you came in as a fake housemate yes at the point that was asking to be a real housemate even when it was time to leave he was feeling so emotional so if that is not a big thing for you then why are you laughing you all came you know all these housemates that tend to talk down on other housemates that they are bigger than them but you guys came for the same show i do not get it comrade attitude says she sounded authentic and sincere chi chi is definitely that girl she didn't sugarcoat anything and never denied the feelings exactly that's what i love i didn't mean she came to that reunion i was saying i never liked him i was playing a game just like some persons would say now we are for verse for chi chi because chi chi was mad over head how would they call it head over his i'll be mad over his which one <laughs> <laughs> now people where they love her they ask so which one hmm. we will there for rather they watch okay Aisha de la Cruz said ah perfume boy is a liar stuttering like a drunk fly or more chichi no lie today I believe her one million percent this one everybody's saying chichi don't lie that means you people see chichi as a liar wahala okay <laughs> it was inten intentional for me not to join the reunion physically that was not what they just said. Please, BB Nigeria reunion. That was not what he said. He said it was not intentional. Not it was intentional. Please, oh, let's be guided. He said he could not make it for a reason. That's why he was not there when Ebuka asked him that he refused to join them. Okay, Big Napua said, Chichi is pretty honestly. I think accent aside, she speaks well and communicates well. I like her some words and I hope she he she is healed and moved on. Whatever happened pure, she can still get a good man and the picket fences if she so desired anyways as you can see everybody is actually you know okay let me finish this deji is a wicked guy he is trying to make himself the victim here but he is very manipulative exactly he's he's trying to play the role of a narcissist and it's not just good for him as a person and i really hope he's not actually like that in real life the, let's just put it this way the truth is that you know badu chichi you understand so he was just you know playing the game as they go he could as well give Chichi the vibe he gave Doi and Alice in them, okay? But he accepted, he gave Chichi the vibe of acceptance, you know? In as much as he was still, you know, trying to show Chichi that it is not that deep, it is not that deep, but it is what it is. Deji just wants to embarrass Chichi, but I am glad she is a strong girl, a queen and more. Deji get locked, say no be fina in jam, if or cry, avoid men like Deji in your life. Anyways, Deji no jam anybody, it's actually Chichi. It is what it is, okay? Meanwhile, let's be waiting for Fina and Groovy Thorn because now I'm carrying load. So, guys, you may see with everything I've just read on the social space, it's given that people, all hands are pointing at Deji that he's the wrong one here. So, feel free to use the comment section. Let me know what you think about all of this. Do you think it is Deji's fault or do you think it's Chichi's fault? Just let me explain yourself. Of course, I'm there with you guys. Let me see what you think about all of this brohaha with Chichi and Deji. Today's episode was just all about Chichi and Deji. Nothing more, nothing else, nothing less, right? Mm -hmm. i have to sign off with my foot chest right now if you've gotten to this session of this video of course you know where you belongs in my heart i love you so much okay i will see you guys there all right bye bye